Hello boys and girls and welcome to another tutorial of um, how to make a San Andreas multiplayer server. Uh, bye bye XSplit, hello OBS. I'm just gonna put that screen on my second screen over there. Yeah, even I have a laptop, I have a second screen so fuck the system um so another tutorial what do we have wait why did i what close that okay so today's topic is tax draws and player tax draws now before we start i'm going to recommend a tax draw editor that i kind of like and as you see here is I Pleo Max Text Draw Editor. I know a lot of you guys and girls, I don't know, are they even girls? <gasps> no. <coughs> Logic. Um I know a lot of people who use uh Zamarot. No, how, how does damn it, how does he pronounce? Wait a moment. Tax draw. No. Uh. Here. Much people use this one probably. I'm not sure. But this. Oh, co come on. This is outdated. Seriously. 2010. How do you work? Wait. Oh. Spanish version. Oh nice. Introduction. Esta es una nueva versión de Antrian. Color rojo. Well, fuck, I'm going off topic here. <laughs> <coughs> yeah. So, I'm not going to use this one. You can actually choose whatever you want, but I'm going to use our Pleo Max Tectro Editor. And I downloaded it already. Uh, bit downloads here it is 7 zip extract I don't use winzip um we don't need the source we what oh boy do we need that shit I maybe have that already let me first check this games it is ah uh, models Takes the how does it called? Plio, yes, I have it already. Nice. Now, uh, so this is fine. Now the sum server here. We don't need that. We don't need that. Wait, why does it? Etd, etd. Oh yeah. Uh, so it uses also a plugin. Maybe, oh, maybe, oh, do, do I have already? Let me see. Desktop. Uh, where is it? Hello, here. Play hands. No, maybe I have it. Oh my god, I'm wasting time here. Play hands. There it is. I have it already. Going to move it to here no oh, fucking to here <coughs> oh. that was oh i'm getting sick no what do we have more string scan format we have already have that then filter script yes we have it also <coughs> we need that also Move it to here. Wait, yes, move it to here. Then edit the server button config. We need a filter shift E D I T D and our plugin I T D and that should work already. Let's see. Loaded successfully, yes, nice. Okay, um, that's alright. Filter script is loaded, support for text yes. Okay, that's fine. 
so as I said I prefer to use this one because if you see the video well no that's actually an older <coughs> an older version actually the video is an older version but you will see I guess I'm not sure <coughs> fuck now I'm afraid that I can't test this when I start when I start San Andreas multiplayer but yeah just go on so we're going to change something here so our text draw editor is installed I don't know why I just showed you guys to make text draw fuck uh, actually I need to <coughs> I need to use it also I first yes I, I'm just gonna oh fuck it faster Michael I'm first gonna uh oh boy what oh it's not in I first gonna make some text draws um, and we're going to replace some things here uh, we're going to replace messages in text row messages uh, yes we will change this <coughs> yes we will change this and the stats so we will need that timer again every three seconds uh, and then we have our call back here this can be uh, I'm just gonna comment it and here we're going to create a text row also but first I'm going to let me change the I'm not sure if OBS can record this I don't think <coughs> yes on this screen oh wow does it actually it does record oh nice except if I stream it to Twitch then it won't probably Uh Okay, so just spawn here and we're going to use the ITD and the comment is ITD. Ah uh, come on, look at this. This is better to make a text row. We're going to add a new project. So test server for oh so for our test server going to manage some text rows we're going to create a new one uh we're going to create a normal one and boom voila there you have it now move it carefully to a place where can I actually what the oh maybe I can move it here yes no, why does it disappear? What? No, whatever. So, we're going to... No, it's better to have it here. Damn it! There we go. Uh, tap? Yes. No? Huh? No, damn it! Shit. Sorry for the words that I used. Okay, it's ex escape. That okay. Well, yeah, whatever. So we're gonna match manage the this text row. Oh, yes, it's already go. Um, the text we're going to say players online, and I'm just gonna x. So that we yes, of course we have to. Wait, can we uh, uh, alignment? Right alignment. Yes, but now. <coughs> now I have to to move it again. What? Oh. Oh.
there we go uh, you can change a color uh, a pre-made color maybe let's do a uh, pleasure line well, lime yes that looks all right so this is a global text row as you see here global now we're going to make a a player text draw for the stat their stats because stats of a player ID is personal so actually per player ID uh, we're going to put it here also in the bottom or actually in the middle you can yes add it in the middle well too bad you can't oh yeah whatever it overlaps now the editor but that's not a problem and the font of those text rows are all right you can also well you can see you can change it and this is my favorite text row. I'm going to set to all uh, I'm going to set the alignment to center and going to move it again yes that's true looks all right the color we're going to change the color to orange nah to light to brown no that looks more like red uh fuchsia <laughs> no <coughs> this is oh black no shit cn uh or just light blue yes that looks alright um, so we have this now and you're going to change the text and uh, the player stats in a text row we're going to show the player um, his score x then we can say uh, let's do uh, minus score and then maybe his uh what can we show uh score and then oh boy uh let me think first score or uh, maybe his ping yeah well then why not and his current weapon these are completely la random things i i'm setting here but you can change this whatever you like um yeah so that looks alright I think yeah or maybe we can we can make a background I mean we create a new and now we're going to create a box we're going to like this in a nice little no wait oh fuck did I delete <laughs> going to make it like my server like this that looks nice and professional <laughs> I guess <coughs> So if you're ready, you can export it. And there it is. Oh sh no, not not yet. Damn it. This has to be a player text row. And now we can export it. So two global text rows and the player text row. So the the here the black bag the box is a is a global one and the player's line is a global one and the score ping weapon is a player one so I'm gonna quit and here we are again um, now you have to go to script files and there it is open with just a fast editor and there you have it um, <coughs> Now we have to call some copy and paste. Um, now, uh, here. So.
So our text draws um our two text draws and our player text draw and I am absolutely why does it have an array I mean an ar a max players that's n so unnecessary because it's a player text they made it because you don't have to use it anymore but no people still add that thing I don't know you will see it still works without that player thing uh, we're going to wait what is player oh yes so te uh, text players online well it's good to name those text draws uh, a good name well fuck how did I say that now players online and then our box and then our stats now we have it here now we have to create those uh, the global ones are made in on game mode in it yeah now we have to actually wait not yet and our player text draw is made in on player connect because it needs a player ID parameter uh, we're going to end uh, on the end <coughs> now let's do before yes no yeah before we actually start scripting for those text draws I'm going to add some important things so destroy player text draw no it's like this problem no player text draw destroy then <laughs> Yes, and that was text draw zero, and then the unnecessary player ID. Oops. Wait. Test player ID. And when the game mode exits, we have to destroy these one also. So. On game mode exit, where is it? Yes, here. Uh, text draw destroy. This one and text draw destroy the <coughs> second one also, the box. And now just control H, yes, control H. Replace text draw zero with players oh players online okay and then just yes do all oh fuck what no all words only oh wait what players online why did it Ah, uh, yeah, I just woke up, so don't blame me. Forward only. Yes, 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 yes. No, this not your fucker. Okay, then we have text row one. And that's <coughs> our box. <coughs> And this can yes do all, and then our player text draw. Where is it? Uh, on player connect. So this filthy ugly thing, just to uh, stats was it right? Yes, 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 yes. yes. Okay, if we compile that, and we have errors. Same as oh what? We have already defined. We have already defined. Oh wait. Uh, just done. Oh my god. Do we really need? Well, txt stats there. 
Control eight stats. Uh, okay. Um, no, this are not. This are not. Yes, 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 yes. No, 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 no. Yes, okay, that's all. Should be where? No, damn it. Float far. Yeah, we don't need that. Just ignore it. Now, I'm already 20 minutes busy, and we don't, we didn't script it yet. So first, we have our global tag draw. A uh, global text draw, so our <coughs> players online. Uh, oh no. If you hear something outside, just ignore it. And it's over. So, our play. Oh, damn it, I lost my. Very, very. Global text draw. Players online. Yeah, so. If. The play if the player connects, we're going to show it, and um, we're going to show the text draw. So, text draw, text draw show for player and not show for all. You have also for all, but no. Just so for the player ID and we have the players players online. <coughs> this will show the text draw when the player connects. So that's already good, but now we have to replace that X. Remember we have that X here. We need to change that to the actual to the actual amount of players online and we can actually now so we have to replace this oh wait yes ignore that <laughs> um, we have to format a string again and then put it in the text draw so format string size <coughs> size of string and then we have so our players online players online then we have the x but the x have to replace with a number so actually with a decimal or an integer an integer integer no just a decimal and our players online well we have we had the variable players connected well we can use that further there you go and then we have to set it as a string and a text draw so we're going to say text draw set string then our text to players online and our string so our format string and then and then we have to show it and then it will add a number or something now you may you may know maybe because uh what the hell I'm talking. You may wonder why well first of all this players online <coughs> and the number will stay always and will not change change, yes. So we're going to add a timer or <coughs> yes we're going to add a timer for that now let's go to our create our player text draw we have three things here um we're going to use the timer stats for that so if you go to there and here we're going to say so i'm go i'm using a timer because the stats of a player can change every second of every minute well of course yes you know now we have to of course show the player so player tax draw show and not tax draw show for player but now just the player id 
and the stats now what txt stats but we have to set a string also for that text row so format string size of string oh. then we had our score that will be a number I'm just gonna percent e then you have our ping uh, I guess ping also e and our weapon our current weapon <coughs> and that will be a string this the weapon name and the weapon ID well no that's no that's not needs so that's easy for our score so get player score of the player player ID then we have our ping get player ping that's also easy and now we have our weapon uh, you may may uh, you may guess it's get player weapon but no it isn't wait Yes, it isn't. This will return only the weapon ID, which we have to get the weapon name. So we're going to delete that. We will use this. And now we have to use the function get. Oh wait, get weapon. The met get weapon name. <coughs> there, weapon ID. Well, this returns the weapon ID down our constant weapon so just a string weapon and size of weapon going to add some new strings here so new string for our format and then our, oh, oh no that's not it and then our um, uh, our weapon weapon yes and that's not a long string so I guess 16 is enough uh, so size of weapon will be 16 weapon so the yes the weapon name will be stored in the weapon so we have to here weapon and this should yes I know float file but we have to player text draw set string player id our txt stats and our string um so that's it actually but we have to as i said we have to for the players online i'm uh, we have to use a timer because that changes also every minute or every seconds actually where when every player connects or disconnects it changes so we're going to use this timer display well, you can add it in a separate timer but I'm not gonna do that I work a lot with timers but uh, sometimes they are bad <laughs> too much timers isn't how to say that isn't um, isn't good so uh, we had uh, let me check back. Uh, player connected. Well, yeah, we just have to. We just have to text draw set string. Yep, no, we have to format again. Format string size of string. Then players connected. No, it's players online. Then our decimal and players connected. Oh, damn it! And then text draw set. No, oh, then I just set string. Um, <coughs> our players online text draw and our string 
and we have to show it again you maybe can hide it first and then show it again but it's still it it works both ways so text draw show for player player id players online compile that no war float far we don't need float far float far wait how does it say we don't use it we do use it look well, I'm going to comment all the float fars we don't need it anymore um, there we go nice and clean uh, close it uh, this can be actually deleted uh, no so if you, you can delete this one and you can start it again the server so we will see uh, oh dear. there we go let's join again and this should work this should work I have normally or I did something stupid we can't test the change thing because we we're only alone we're forever alone so we're going to be alone in server and there you have the first dex draw players online one well yes one player online and that's me let's spawn uh, and there we oh yes and there you see our stats and we forgot our box let's get first our box uh, stats text draw show for player 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 ID <coughs> box and you're going to say that when he connects no we're going to no together with this F5 everything's fine restart uh, restart and join again yes and then it should work so we have our global text draw the players online and we have a player text draw and so the difference between a player text draw and a text draw a global text draw is that a player text draw is for a player id only and a global is for everyone <coughs> so um and you see our box already and there we have our weapon ping and score we have zero score that's right we have a nice stick in our hands that's right now we have a shotgun look it changes and now we have nothing wait what does it show nothing huh So yeah, that's it for today. You can also show his money. Yeah, you can show his money also. And that's just the same like... Uh, the same... You just add here money. Or you replace something. Money, blah, blah, blah. And, take, and then just here, get player money. That will work. Also, you can just add or delete things for the player ID. Well, player ID things. And that's it for now. So I'm 30. We are on 35 minutes almost. That's a good time because uh, seems I uh, explained for too long. Well, if you notice, my previous videos are actually long. 
depends on the topic we are talking about. So part 11 is done and next time filter script I don't know. I don't know. I'm just still thinking what to do. Uh, so this is it. Uh, leave a like if you uh, enjoyed the video. If you learned something. Uh, you can favorite, leave a subscribe if you want more of this. <coughs> and don't forget to suggest, su you can suggest things what to explain. If you suggest, yes. So that's it for now. Um, ooh, screen inception again. 35 minutes and we're going to stop in 7, 6, 5, 4. So thanks guys for watching and I'll see you next time.